So right now we're going to open our my files uh, on your Android phone. That's how it is. Hi guys, this is Vince. Welcome to my vlog. Uh, today I'm going to show you how we'll be able to access our files from your desktop, from your uh, Android phone. I'm, I'm using Android phone actually. I just experienced a while ago and I, I'm thinking uh, I, should, I should make a video out of this experience. I want to view my, I want to see actually, I want to copy some files from my uh, uh, desktop from my laptop to my Android phone and uh, I know we can use cable we can use USB flash drive but I want to try a different way uh, without using those uh, cable or flash drive so what I'm going to show you right now is uh, uh, accessing those files on your desktop using the Samsung uh, file uh, manager app the file manager manager app of uh, Samsung, which is uh, and by the way I'll be using Samsung since my my phone is Samsung, and I'll, I'll be using my uh, Samsung Note uh, 20 Ultra. Uh, I don't know if, if it's possible using other phone or iOS. I I don't know, but uh, for those who uses Samsung, usually it will be available and you'll be able to do the same. Uh, it is useful you don't need a cable you didn't you don't need a USB flash drive or you don't need anything just uh, connect to your network and access those those file directly take it copy it and then open it on your uh, on your Android phone that's how it is uh, it is usually faster if you connect a cable directly USB cable but sometimes you just want to see what's uh, directly, like directly from your mobile uh, without using any of those uh, accessories. So things you need to have uh, to do this activity is uh, first, you should have your uh, laptop or PC, the IP address of your PC, and then you should have your Samsung uh, mobile. Uh, and then uh, those Samsung Mobile, it's having a file, my file or file, my file apps. This one, my file apps. This my file apps should have that one, and uh, you're good to go. I'll just uh, give you some few instruction, and you'll be within a minute. You'll be able to access those file. So first of all, you have to know the IP address. That is really easy to uh, accomplish. Just uh, open your desktop and then log on and then uh, on the search bar type on the search bar you can type in CMD CMD and then on that first line on the command prompt type IP config you can scroll down and see which which one is the Wi-Fi adapter Wi-Fi LAN adapter, Wi-Fi. And then on that one, you can see IPv4 address. IPv4 address. The IPv4 address is your IP address, which is on, on my desktop, that is 192.168.1.20. So uh, then, you have to take note, you should be connected on the same Wi-Fi network. The same Wi-Fi network, for example, uh, this one, Wi-Fi network, I'm connected to my personal Wi-Fi, uh, the Lima 1-5G. This is my Wi-Fi network. So, my My Files application is there, that Samsung My File application. And then, uh, I should be connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Same Wi-Fi network. See, I am connected to the same Wi-Fi network, the Lima 1-5G. The same as uh, my laptop Wi-Fi connection. Uh, then on my desktop, we will identify which uh, files we want to, uh, which files we want to share. Or you want to share the whole directory, you can also share the whole direct C directory. But uh, for example, in this example, I want to share, for example, my document. 
my document for example my document for example I will create some new file folder share folder for example share folder this is the folder I'll be sharing I'll be creating some uh, new files test file test share file I will be creating the text file and then blah 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 test I'll be using the test uh, I'll be using this file save it save and that's it uh, so I should be able to see I can create another files maybe open new for example new file for example word file test word share mm, this word share okay what's inside nothing is inside for this file <laughs> nothing so we'll just write test okay we'll just write test that's it what's inside test share because a test share mm, save it save it okay those are the files inside our uh, our, our share folder which we're planning to share so in this one this folder we should be able to set this one as a share folder how to do this how to share this file you just right click right click properties sharing share then uh, for example I'm the owner Vince uh, for example I will share to everyone everyone can access this file so share so this is the path this is the path shared folder okay mm. the name of my for the name of my desktop desktop dash rqg blah 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 that is the name of my uh, desktop so that is the name of my desktop Oh, so this is the, the full this is now the full share folder share path network path of my shared folder so any PC any laptop any desktop Android as well any other uh, devices can now access this folder from their mobile or from their devices so uh, now we're going to go to our uh, uh, Android phone so on our Android phone phone so on our Android phone we'll open the my files this one my files my files you can actually search this one from uh, here from search bar for example how to search for example my files this one click the specs and uh, my type my files my file see it's it's coming directly my files and then uh, from here you have several option storage you have the storage you have the SD card you are the one drive Google Drive and then on the last one the last one says uh, network storage we'll select network storage and then we're going to add so we're going to add network drive nothing found then uh, you can add 192.168.1.20 port 445 username that is my username then my password then add hopefully it will add i don't know. yeah it got added yes it got added now so now i'm inside that pc now i am inside that pc uh i can browse user the new user vince then uh, that is on my document document and then share folder that's it those are the files see these are the files inside my PC. See that? Those are the files. These are the files. See? 
So those are the files. The test word share and test share file. Yeah, the test the test share file and the test word file. That's it. Then you can copy, for example, you want to copy this file, so you want to copy these files. Or the folder itself, if you want to copy the whole folder, you want to copy the share folder, copy, this one, copy, copy, and to wherever, which directory you want to file, for example, you want to copy in your SD card, you want to copy in your SD card here, copy in your SD card, so you just click uh, on your SD card, see, SD card, and then copy click copy and that's it yeah the share folder is there already oops see whoa you can open the file okay test well that's what's inside that's what's inside the 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 file that is test so that's it or you can actually you can for example again you go go to the network network storage and then you can just directly this is the one right 192.168.1.20 uh, you can just open directly from the, the from the files itself from the from the folder itself document share folder you can open this one directly test word share open okay see you're opening from the desktop itself you can edit, I think. It depends. I don't know if you have the, the authority to edit. But you can copy. You can copy, you can open, you can view. That's it. It's easy. So that's it, guys. That's how we uh, will be able to access and read the file from your desktop to your uh, mobile phone, Android phone specifically. I don't have any iOS phone, send me one so I can test. <laughs> uh, so I'm using my Samsung Note Ultra. I hope the information will be usable on your daily task and then I uh, hope it uh, helps you. Uh, thank you for watching my blog and uh, please uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you very much. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.